The girl with a pearl earring, the latest target of climate protesters. How do you feel when you see something beautiful and priceless being apparently destroyed before your eyes? This video published on social media shows one activist trying to superglue his head to the world-famous artwork, while another empties what looks like a tin of tomato soup over him. A bold activism stunt that left a mixed reaction among visitors at the Mauertos Museum in The Hague. Even though I'm, I might be even uh, in favour of what they want to achieve, uh, this is not the way to do it. And I don't think they will get a lot of um, support by the public. You must keep your hands off such a beautiful painting. It's not very respectful. A few days earlier, Just Stop Oil activists smeared cake over a statue of King Charles III at Madame Tussauds in London. While in Germany, Claude Monet's haystacks was covered in mashed potatoes. We are in the middle of a climate catastrophe, and the only thing we are afraid of is tomato soup or potato on a painting. Vincent van Gogh's sunflowers at London's National Gallery and the Mona Lisa at the Louvre in Paris have also been on the receiving end of food-related climate protests. Extreme methods that this climate activist says are the most effective way to get people's attention. Given that people clearly don't seem to be giving much thought to the fact that it's 20 degrees in Paris in October and 35 degrees in the south, maybe targeting things which people are more affected by, maybe art, famous paintings, it has the power to make people more aware of this fight and its urgency. No damage was done to this masterpiece or the others thanks to protective glass.